Welcome back to the Mind, Body, Soul of Homemaking. If you are new, my name is Audrey. I make motivational homemaking videos, wife life content, traditional living, slow living. So if you're interested in that, hit the subscribe button below. I'd love to have you. I hope to inspire and motivate you as homemakers, wives, and mothers. Of course, my battery is dying. <sighs> we'll be back. Okay, we're back. So today, um, as many of you know, we moved. So I just wanted to do a quick home tour and do a few odds and ends for the evening time. So this is an evening time of homemaking. Yeah, thank you for being patient with me. Hopefully you find some homemaking motivation and get inspired as homemakers. Yes, he's eating my to-do list. 4.15 and got off to a late start. That's okay. I have to sweep and mop the floors, take Coda for a run, because he's getting antsy. Um, I want to clean and organize Josiah's room. Love Every actually sent me like a little play area mat tent for him, which I'm super excited about. And I'm hoping to do like a review for you guys. Yes, I know Coda. I need to make chicken pot pie. I don't have any instant crust, so I'm gonna make some homemade crust. I will bring you guys along. And if you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. It really does help out my channel. Say, <laughs> All right, so this is what it looks like when you first walk in. And my desk here. You'll see, obviously, you recognize the furniture from the last house. I get it from every angle so you guys can get an overall feel, but Josiah, Josiah, what's the matter? Hi, baby. You want to say hi? You want to say hi? Oh. Walk through here. This is what we would call the dining room area. We're going to put a carpet here with our dining room table. And we're going to get rid of this 1950s wood burner. Eventually when we save up and get like a nice wood burner behind this is actually a fireplace But they closed it off and we found that on Facebook marketplace. It was disgusting So I cleaned it and painted it and put some lights in it. You walk in here. This is the laundry room area We're waiting for a part for our dryer Hopefully we'll switch it out and get like a white one, but for now we just found this on Facebook marketplace And it's gonna have to do I will try to insert some pictures of what this looked like before, but like I said, this place was disgusting when we found it. I put Minnie's litter box under here, and yeah, this is a working progress. This is the kitchen area. I put my corner hutch here with all my teacups and everything, and this is our bar area. Starting from left to right, we have our hutch there with all our spices, potato bin, fridge, pantry, Sorry if it's shaky, Josiah is <laughs> trying to grab the strap. We are actually planning on painting the cabinets white, so that is in the process. Obviously, I had to hang my lights because this would not be the mind body soul homemaking without some sort of twinkling light. <laughs> this and behind it, I'm gonna try and get a window mirror to make it look like there's a window behind the shutters. I'm gonna make some chicken pot pie. I have a little bit of Candy King goodies there.
around with someone better Until then I will pause forever Keep taking my time through boxes and light We were so good at flying, but we can't keep flying We keep getting stuck on the wrong side of the mountain We were so good at trying, but we can't keep trying Cause we only end up on the wrong side of the mountain This is going to be Josiah's room. Um, I'm going to put his little play mat tent in the corner there. I'm going to hang some pictures up. This picture actually was the picture that was in my room. Well, closet. <laughs> Alright. As a little girl, so I'll open it up and show you. But put his little rocking chair in the corner there. And. The work in progress. We can keep flying, we keep getting stuck on the wrong side of the mountain. So good at trying, but we can keep trying. We only end up on the wrong side of the mountain. Are you ready to open your present? Hmm? So being a first time mom, it's really overwhelming to know how to help Josiah's brain development and you know with so many subscriptions out there, Love Every really caught my eye with the colors, the quality and just the overall appearance and like the creative development process that went into the concept behind their brand. So I reached out to them and I just feel like, you know, despite everyday stresses of raising Josiah and between the move. I think having toys or a toy subscription box like Love Every really put my mind at ease with being a new mom that despite everything else feeling out of control, this is, you know, the one thing that I don't have to think about every month and you know that it's going to bring joy not only to you, Josiah and, or your child but also to you. So because I find that for the most part I have to be down on the floor with him you know, and if the toys that they're not stimulating me, I know that they're not stimulating his, you know, cognitive development. And I just hope I can work with Love Every more in the future and show you all his growth along the way. And also, they're a really good gift giver if you're not someone who has children, but you know of somebody who does. I look at these toys as tools, really, to help, you know, Josiah's brain development and to challenge him and help him to be better at problem solving. So they're definitely tools, um, but obviously they're toys to them. You like your new thing? Yeah! Oh! It's a little better than before, obviously. It's a work in progress. I'm still moving things around, but yeah. Trying to get maybe like a little hutch over here or a dresser. Um, he loves this. I love it too. It's so cute. set this matching set on Facebook for only $200 I was stoked <laughs> when I found that but yeah this is the bedroom it's coming along Miss um, congeniality is playing right now and as you walk in here this is our sunroom let me turn on the light here 
is the sunroom slash tea party room slash hobby room. Um, I think I'm gonna move that picture, but this was gifted to me. I absolutely love it. It's perfect to have like a book nook here and look out the window and I hung my bird feeder up out there. No birds have come yet. I'm wondering how to lure them other than put food out there. <laughs> so I don't know. But my mirror in the corner here, I found these thrifted vintage curtains at one of my local thrift stores. I think they were like $10 and they're like floral here. I really like them. I really like the little pops of green in here. Um, just to give it like a nice earthy feel. So yeah, I put my vanity over here where I get ready um, and then my clothes. I put my desk over here. Uh, I'm gonna hang like a picture and I'm still not finished and I need to get a chair. So that will be my desk. But yeah, this is my sunroom. I am absolutely in love with it. Super excited, it's slowly coming together. I'm looking forward to spending a lot of time in here and doing a lot of projects and filming and just a bunch of odds and ends. This is the bathroom. It's pretty big. <laughs> and if you're familiar with my channel, you know why this makes me happy. I want to paint these white um, and the border I want to paint white. I tried to do my best to organize. I put our sheets and linens up there and just, you know, bathroom stuff. <laughs> Through here, this is the guest room. Joe's desk office area here. This is the guest room. Still coming together. ladies as always thank you so much for always supporting my channel and leaving comments and being so loving and I I really appreciate it and I hope that you can you know take care of yourself mind body and soul and I hope that I can in some way help you and inspire you through these videos to do that and just to be the best you know homemaker that you can be and to take one day at a time and take care of yourself and your mental health and I just wanted to do a little shout out to Madison and Evelyn Ashton and Christopher Jr. Thank you so much for watching my channel. These are little kiddos of Beth Ann's and they're longtime subscribers and I just wanted to say thank you and Coda says hello and Minnie says hi and we will see you all in our next video. Okay bye!